Time for Vox Africa special. Vox Africa joined Bisake Day during his UK tour, which kicked off at Camden Centre, London. Bisake Day, who won High Life Artist of the Year, sold out the show with an excited crowd, which couldn't wait for him to perform. The entertaining night was supported by Afrobeat UK-based artists, such as UG and Selassie. Let's hear from some of the special guests who turn up to show love backstage. We're here tonight with UG and he's gonna tell us what he's up to tonight and in the future. Yep. So obviously I'm supporting Aquaba UK. They've been supporting me since I started doing my music properly. So they called me, told me that they wanted me to open up for Bisa. I like Bisa as an art artist as well. So I said, it's only right that I come here, you know, and bless the stage as well. So yeah, that's what's going on today. So what should we expect from you tonight? Um, straight fire. Obviously, I've got um, a song that's going viral right now called Dance With Me. So I'm hoping that when I perform that, I make the crowd go wild. But yeah, I'm looking to light up the stage. What are you up to as an artist this year? Uh, it's quite a lot still. Um, we've been recording music for the last like two, three months. I'm also working on an EP with Mr. Easy. Um, so we're going to do a joint EP and I think I'll release my mixtape later this year. But videos, tours, everything that you can expect and you want is going to happen very, very soon. So Selassie, yeah. she's a singer, she's a dancer. So what brought you here tonight? Well, you know, I've been asked to come here to perform, to entertain everyone that's out here. So I'm here to just give good energy, good vibes and just enjoy the performance. So you're performing tonight? Is dancing or singing? I'm doing both. Both. Singing and dancing. So expect a great, a great, 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 great performance. Tell us about your career. I started, you know, putting out my own music out there. Started with my first song, Wutu, which is an acronym for Wake Up To Yourself. That came out last year, December. And I've recently also released uh, my latest track, which is called Bobo Deji, which is in my, my language, called Ewe. And um, that came out on my birthday, actually, in March. And it's doing quite well, actually, so far. People are loving it. Everyone's, you know, enjoying it. So I'm hoping the crowd out there will enjoy it as well. How are you feeling tonight? I'm feeling very excited. <laughs> oh, tell us, how does it feel to be Miss Ghana, to win the competition, and what have you been up to? Do you know what? It's, it's been a blessing. Um, Miss Ghana's been overwhelming, but I've, I'm loving it so far. Um, so far, I'm working on a project and mentoring um, program. So I'm trying to team up um, vulnerable young people within our community with professionals as well, just so they can be good role models to them and help them with career and life advice. What brought you here tonight? Do you know what? I love Mr. KD. My favorite song of his, uh, Mansa and Brother Brother. I just love Bisakede, so I thought I need to be here tonight. Before Bisakede's performance, UG gave us a test of his top hits from Buddy to Dance for Me with the Al Qaeda Contagious Moves. Followed by Selassie, singer and dancer, who sang hits such as Wutu, spiced up with her incredible and sassy choreography. Thank <laughs> you. 
Officer Kede, who was highly anticipated, made appearance on stage with his number one hit, Brother Brother, followed by his other biggest hits, including Mansa. <laughs> Let's hear from Bisa after performance. So, Bisa, how are you feeling tonight? I'm feeling so good tonight, trust me. The love that London has showed me tonight is just amazing. I want to say thank you to everybody who came out to support. You know. What did you expect from the crowd tonight? Were you satisfied? I mean, I was, I was expecting that kind of connection, you know, between um, me and my fans, and they gave me that, so yeah. It was good. It was just awesome. Would you come back to London and perform? I mean, London is like my second home, you know. Any, I'm, I'm here all the time, so anytime my Londoners call me for a show, yeah, I'm always at their service. That's what's okay for you. The Hitmakers UK tour surely had a good start before his next stop to Leicester. Let's go. 